the Punchestown Champion Chase is next. It's a two-mile grade one. And this is another one of those, one of those excellent Paul Parsons form guides on the forum. If you haven't seen those, you can get in and have a look at them. They have pretty good stuff. Buckhouse, John Morgan at the top. El Centro rated Vinnie Gerard. Gabriel's Rhapsody, Darren Thompson. Royal Promise, Greg Beckwith. The Pretty Boy, Joshua Sutherland. Alien Senator, Leon Van Rensburg. Daisy Padme for David Robertson. And Swiss Princess for John Morgan. Just eight runners in this then. Called in and away. I don't know why it's such a small field for this. It's a top quality race. It's a grade one, two miles. You'd think there'd be a much bigger field. But there's not for some reason. And Buckhouse has gone into lead. And that could be the reason. Because Buckhouse is lowered a blazer trail here. And we've seen in the past that when Buckhouse goes, the rest of them don't. And Buckhouse wins by a mile if he gets given an easy lead. The thing is which is the problem for John Morgan, is that he doesn't always jump the fences. And they get to the first of the ten, he's jumped that one okay. And he's over it clear of the pretty boy in second. And Gabriel's Rhapsody is third, Swiss Princess on the outside is fourth, and then Daisy Padme. And towards the back hill centre and right is a back marker. I'm pretty sure Philly Gerard says that this one's running over the wrong trip and needs another half mile, but... If they go full pelt, then you never know. Sort of stamina might end up playing into it. I don't know. I'll see what happens, really. It all comes down to these. So it makes it fascinating for me as the commentator when John's got these horses in because I know I keep banging on about it, but it's like the other week we saw the race at Warwick where his horse went off miles in front and they were all strung out like washing. And then the one in front fell and the pace just dropped right off and the whole field concertinaed up and we're all in a clump then and it ended up in a tactical sort of sprint finish. Whereas if John's all stays on their foot, stay on their feet. They tend to get the others thinking about it, and they end up falling. And it's um, a different kettle of fish altogether. And that's what's happening at the moment. Here we're already getting down towards the halfway point, and Buckhouse hasn't put a foot wrong so far. Swiss Princess is in second. Gabriel's Rhapsody on the inside is third. Then Pretty Boy after that. Royal Promise is next. And Alien Senator at the back two are El Centro rated and Daisy Padme. Buckhouse coming back to the field as they get over the six, but I've got a feeling that's just a little bit of a tactic mid-race breather there. And Buckhouse is in the lead. Coming down to the seventh, popped over that one nicely already. The second was Gabriel's Rhapsody out in central. That one's outside his third. Then Swiss Princess, the pretty boy on the inside. Then Royal Promise, El Centro rated his next. Daisy Padme struggling out the back there. Well strung out as you'd expect. And Buckhouse continuing to lead. Although one or two of them in behind look to be going pretty well. As they head down towards the third from home. And Buckhouse is going to lead into it. And he popped over that one nicely from Alien Sending to Gabriel's Rhapsody. Now the pretty boy being switched out by held in there by Swiss Princess. Then after that one comes Royal Promise. As Buckhouse races down towards the final two. This is the second last of the final ditch. And a really good jump by the lead and got away from it well. Swiss Princess has moved into second. Gazel's Rhapsody is third. Royal Promise on the outside. Four Alien Senator and the Pretty Boy have got a lot of work to do. It's Buckhouse in the lead with two and a half furlongs to go home. One more fence to get over. It's Buckhouse from Stable Companion. Swiss Princess. Gabriel's Rhapsody is back in third. Alien Senator. Royal Promise. The Pretty Boy. They're not making any ground on the leader at the moment. It's Buckhouse coming into this final fence but now being taken on by his companion. That's how they go. It's staying his Buckhouse in the lead. Swiss Princess, though, beginning to get up on the outside. Gabriel's Rhapsody now throwing down a big challenge on the outside as well. The Pretty Boy is flying, but they're inside the final half furlong. It's Swiss Princess in the lead. The Pretty Boy is flying on the outside. Swiss Princess needs the line. Here comes Pretty Boy, and Pretty Boy gets up and steals it. The Pretty Boy takes it. Swiss Princess was second. And that race was set up perfectly by Buckhouse. <laughs> There's been a little bit of rivalry and a friendly rivalry I've got to say in the forums between Josh and John about that and Josh will be no doubt delighted about the way he's all swept round the outside and took it when it looked like we were on the on the way to a John Morgan 1-2 with the pretty boy takes it for Joshua Sutherland Swiss Princess John Morgan 2nd Gabriel's Rhapsody Darren Thompson 3rd Buckhouse John Morgan 4th all four of those ran great races and then 5th was Alien Senator for Leon Van Rensburg.